from the toolbar select this ellipse tool now by pressing shift key make it a circle and fill this circle with color now place it at the center by dragging and using alt key make it a duplicate and change the color drag it down and make it a little bit smaller now select both go to layer combine and subtract it now select this do copy and paste in place and go to edit transform and vertical now drag it down and make it smaller in size and by using arrow key take it upward now it looks perfect now take rectangular tool and here draw a rectangle now fill this rectangle with color now align them horizontally select this take convert point tool and select this point by using left arrow key on your keyboard move the point towards left hand side similarly select this right point and move it towards right hand side by using arrow key and here drag it and drag it towards downward and make a shape like this let's place this new object to the back so by dragging the layer you can place it to the back and take it upward like this by using arrow key and by using pen tool here draw the leaf you can control the handle of the curve by using alt key now fill the shape with color select this do copy and paste in place go to edit transform and horizontal now bring towards left hand side by using left arrow key on your keyboard drag the shape little bit down and make it smaller in size now select them all do right click over the layer and rasterize it after rasterizing select this do quick selection now go to select and expand it so here give some expanding value okay now select the down object and press delete key on your keyboard now ctrl d and remove the selection now select this object take eraser tool and erase those unnecessary area let's rotate the shape so that it can look nice at the bottom rotate this one too and place it here now delete this similarly select this do quick selection select expand it and select the down object press delete key ctrl d and remove the selection select this one take eraser tool and delete unnecessary area now take text tool and write the company title drag it and make the size bigger and place it here by using alt key 
drag the text and make a duplicate and edit it double click and here write more text similarly make duplicate once more by using alt key and edit it let's change the font from the character so we'll use different font for this text now take ellipse tool and at the bottom we'll make a small shape fill this with color now drag this ellipse by pressing alt key and make a duplicate and change the color let's change the color select both go to layer combine and subtract it take ellipse tool once again and here we'll draw a shadow fill this ellipse with color select this one do quick selection and uh, go to select and expand it okay now select the new ellipse press delete key ctrl d and remove the selection and we are done let's change the color so select this and double click on the layer click on gradient and here you can uh, mix your own color similarly use a uh, gradient color to the other objects like this so this way change the color select them all now drag the layers and make it a group unmark this background now let's open the mocha file if you don't have mocha file then you can check on the description and you can download it now double click at the top layer of the mockup and drag our logo over the new mockup tab and leave it here yes and place it at the center you can increase the size of the logo mark it unmark the mockup background close the tab and wait for the mockup to be applied so once the mockup will apply here you'll see the result hope you like this tutorial you can subscribe our channel do support thank you